What is up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here. Today we're opening the first ever Star Wars Smuggler Bounty Box that has come through Amazon, so part of the new Amazon subscription service. And I guess it doesn't really say, but uh, kind of you can see on the top of the box here, it does have Cloud City and a Twin Pod Cloud Car, so the theme for this is Cloud City, I believe. So I'll have to see what kind of pop we get in here. So again, this is Amazon, through Amazon now, so I don't know what they're changing or anything, um, but I hope we still get some cool stuff in here. But let's go and start off. So first off, We've got a mystery minis. I love these things. I like lining them up on the desk back here. But this time it looks like we've got a Chewbacca with C-3PO on his back. Of course, when C-3PO gets all destroyed and everything by whosoever is hiding in the room with all the Ugnaughts and stuff in the incineration room. He gets destroyed, I assume, a Stormtrooper. But he gets blasted to pieces till Chewie comes and finds him and tries to put him back together and has him on his back. So let's get this open. So here is Chewbacca, and this looks pretty big compared to the others. I can grab like the Lando or something here. So of course, I like how they did increase the size, of course, for Chewbacca and everything. But it just looks overall bigger like size, but like I said, it may just be because it's Chewbacca himself. But of course, it's a Star Wars, so it's got the bobble head, unfortunately, and I don't like that. But these things don't bobble too much. He's got his gun there, not the bowcaster, just a normal gun, there in his hands. And then, of course, if you flip it around, we've got uh, C-3PO, sorry, there in a little uh, sack or bag on on his back and he's you know built from the waist up and so he's there he's got his head upper torso and hands and stuff at least one hand and then he's got his legs sticking out and a hand in the back and stuff so that's pretty fun and cool and um, another fun little mystery mini to add to the collection next up we've got a keychain so again another keychain that I don't care about at all but it is of Lando's head and it's just one of those thin flimsy keychains and stuff again I don't care anything about that well our pop is stuck in the box but I'll just show it here now we'll look at it in a second but it is Boba Fett it says Boba Fett gets his bounty another movie mo moments which I love these Star Wars movie moments I have all but from The Last Jedi and stuff so far. But wait, this is pretty cool and I want to get it out but it's stuck in the box so I gotta have to rip the box up to get this out. So I finally got it out now. So as you can see we've got a Boba Fett standing there and this is inside of uh, the carbonation chamber or whatever uh, from uh, Cloud City and stuff obviously. And so we've got Han Solo Frozen and Carbonite um, laying there on the floor which is kind of weird. I wish it would be the stand up version so you could see it a little bit better but it's just laying down on the, there on the floor. But I like the background how you can see the um, stairs and everything and see a little silhouetted Darth Vader over like right in there um, standing up on top of the stairs and everything. So let's go and open this to get a better look at it. So here it is out of the box so you can get a better view. Again here is Boba Fett just in the normal classic Boba Fett looking look. I assume they updated it because they went from I don't know if there's been a Boba Fett more recently. I think there has been um, but they went, of course, from the more classic cartoony look that I have um, back there on the shelf to more realistic looking that they've done to Pops um, within the past couple years. So I assume it's an upgraded look overall for Boba Fett, but nothing real special about him, just the same Boba Fett as always. And then we've got Han there in Car Frozen and Carbonite Lane on the like big giant pad or whatever on the floor of the freezing chamber and stuff and I like of course the orange lights and stuff that are all coming through the bottom that you can see that I really like that display and stuff like I said I wish this would be standing up because then you have you know like more view where this it just looks like Boba Fett and that's about it and with because this is so far down and there's not you know his head's not sticking up too far and stuff so it's like just looks like he's looking at like a table or something but um once you realize what it is stuff it does look pretty cool and I like this a lot and again I love these movie moments and I hope they keep making them but I kind of don't as well because they take up a lot of space and I don't have all the room for them but that's going to be it for our Amazon version of the Star Wars Smugglers Bounty with um, Cloud City so like um, notice that we didn't get a whole lot of items we got the move moments which these are pretty expensive they're at least $25 which I think is close to what the box costed um, itself so you know that's kind of most of the thing there then we got this little mystery mini then a keychain that I don't care about or anything but I still enjoyed it and I cannot wait for the next month which I've advertised as um, Jabba's uh, skiff I think is what it's called which I love the whole Java scene um, from start to end of Return of the Jedi so I'm super excited to see who we get what if we get any new characters maybe that are on the skiff that we didn't we don't have yet um, you know some of the like background characters and stuff or we could get like a movie moments like this with a skiff that'd probably be really cool too with all the different characters but I hope you come back in I guess two months to see that one. But that's gonna be it for this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a thumbs up for us. Leave any comments you have down below and don't forget to subscribe to see more of our videos and we'll see you next time.